We are extremely excited to be here to represent Notre Dame and to give just a little bit back to the military for all the things they've done to us. We're honored that we were invited to this and look forward to the opportunity. I think it was a little scary for us. You know, I, I think we were wondering um, how the wind was going to be, how the sun was going to be. Um, we, we borrowed some eye black from the football team just in case, and uh, you know, trying to figure out the wind, how we're going to get to the basket, and defensively, or is that going to change some things that we're doing? So I think a lot of things, at least those were things running through my head. I, I think for them, they were kind of just thinking, "Wow, wow, that ship is big," and the ocean is really close. If we turn it over, we might not get it back. You mentioned that uh, you were honored to be invited to this. Was there any hesitation when you were first approached that, you know, hey, this isn't what we usually do and I, you know, I've got a season to prepare for? You know, I, I think initially you thought about um, just the concept, you know, and, and thought, okay, wait a minute, we're playing outside. Is that something that we uh, we really want to do? And and then when we learned a little bit more about it and, and how it was going to work, and the success they had last year with Michigan State playing North Carolina, that went over so well. And so I, I think as soon as we started talking about it with the players and with other people, everybody was so excited. They really embraced the idea right off. I mean, I know it's a big game right away. Um, can you, how do you, can you evaluate, can you evaluate what goes on up there tomorrow because it's so different in the atmosphere, so out of the order? I don't know, because I think we're uh, going to be a really good shooting team, but I'm not sure that we're going to be a good shooting team tomorrow. And uh, so, I, you know, I think we'll, we'll probably look at execution and defensively some things that we're trying to do. Um, can we rebound? And, and there's certain fundamentals I think that are going to be constant no matter what the, the, the elements are. Um, but, I mean, really, I, I think it's a game to just see. Here's where we are right now. First game of the season. It's a long season. Um, this is not going to be uh, uh, the beginning or end of anything. Uh, I think uh, the journey's long, and we just want to see where we are right now. Was there anything you did, like in South Bend? We did not. No, we um, we thought about it, but we we had kind of a cold streak there, uh, where it was going to be tougher to get outside. So we almost practiced outside on the way over here uh, at one of the parks when we couldn't get on the ship. But uh, we have not been outside. You know, for us, this game is a lot about Daniel Green, a uh, former player of ours who uh, is with us here, uh, graduated from Notre Dame in 2000, went to Iraq, had her arm blown off uh, by a missile, and has been then back to talk to the team and be around the team. And so for us, it's, uh, it's a little bit of a way to thank her and to thank all the troops for what they've done. So I think the girls are really excited to be able to have a chance to give something back. And especially when we talked about the Wounded Warrior Fund, uh, that is just an amazing organization and if any little bit we can do to help them we're proud to do. God put the Notre Dame in so much the university. What's the mean to you personally to be here and represent the University of Dame on Well you know you, you just you don't have this opportunity very often in your career and for us being from Notre Dame uh, with Father Hesburgh getting started on God Country Notre Dame um, it, you have an opportunity to do something really historic and to have the first women's game, uh, I think, is a great thing for Notre Dame, and to be able to represent not just Notre Dame, but uh, but everyone in women's basketball to be here today.